What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to the channel. Recently, Ontario's Premier Doug Ford announced that Ontario will be scrapping emissions tests very soon, and that's what I'm going to be talking about today. So here in Ontario, emissions tests were first introduced back in 1999 because of environmental concerns. As of April 1st, 2019, Ontario will be scrapping emissions tests because they say it is no longer needed for non-commercial vehicles like family vehicles and stuff like that. However, they are going to be introducing a new program to deal with commercial vehicles, large trucks and stuff like that. Now it is unclear what this new program is going to include, but they are going to announce and share that with us very soon. One of the reasons they are deciding to scrap emissions tests here in Ontario is because most people, whenever they go to get the test done, most of them pass anyway, so it's not really a useful program anymore. Now, the one good thing I've seen with this program is back whenever I worked automotive parts and service, I worked there for five years, and over those five years, I have seen plenty of vehicles come in our shop that honestly shouldn't be on the road. Even though we did not do emissions tests at our shop, we still, if we seen a problem, we would share that with the customer, show them and explain to them that they might not pass their emissions test because of this problem. And most of the time they would have the work done or whenever they get the emissions test done, they would get the work done then. So to be able to get the emissions test done, it used to cost around 30 or $40 to the vehicle owner, which honestly isn't that expensive, but most people still didn't like getting it done because it was a hassle to be able to get their vehicle into the shop to be able to get it done. I think it needed to be done every other year. So every two years having to do that, it was a big struggle for everybody. One thing that people don't realize is these shops had to still pay their tax. Most of the time these tax would be making over $20 an hour and these tax had to have a special license to be able to conduct the e-test themselves. On top of that, any shop that does the emissions tests has to either purchase the machine themselves, which is extremely expensive or rent it out monthly, which is still pretty expensive. So the Ontario government back a few years ago decided that customers are not going to have to pay it for themselves anymore. That now, instead of the customer paying for the e-test, the Ontario government will be paying for it. But one thing a lot of people don't understand is they are not paying these shops $40 each time they do emissions tests. Most shops were lucky to get $20 per test they conduct. Now the test itself usually took around an hour and if you have to pay your tech about $20 or more an hour, all of the money that the Ontario government is paying you, you are basically giving to the tech. And the shop still had to rent out this machine monthly which was still expensive. So most stops started to close their emissions tests, they stopped doing the emissions tests and it became very stressful for people whenever it came time that they needed to get it done because if not many shops are offering the emissions test anymore, there's no real point to have it done. And also by them scrapping it, it is going to be saving Ontario taxpayers about $40 million in the end. So to me, it is worth it. To me, as somebody that worked automotive retail parts and service for five years, even though my shop did not offer emissions test, I did see the benefit from it. I have seen plenty of vehicles come in our shop throughout the years that honestly should not be on the road. Most of them, however, were just safety issues, which has nothing to do with emissions tests, but there was a lot of them with the emissions test that honestly should not have been on the road. And I think by the Ontario government scrapping it in total, I think it will cause harm in the end, but I still think it is a good thing just because so many shops stop offering it. People had to drive so far away. It honestly was not worth it. The only other thing I think that they possibly could have done would be that instead of getting it every two years, have people get it every five years. I think that would have worked out a little bit better, but I do like the idea of them scrapping it. So these are my opinions on Ontario scrapping the emissions tests. Comment down below what you think. Do you think it's good or bad that Ontario is deciding to scrap this? Do you think it is going to have an effect on the environment? Me, myself, I don't think it is because they are technically right. It is mostly big trucks and commercial vehicles that are causing more harm to the environment than non-commercial vehicles and family vehicles. So to me, I do think it is going to work out. Comment down below. I really want to see what you guys think. This has been another Takedown Views video. I hope you guys did enjoy and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.